back to my channel today's video is another grocery haul as promised i think i'm gonna do a grocery haul every single time we do groceries for the most part we do it once every two weeks we'll do like a big grocery haul and then in between like in the middle of the weeks if we need to get like some milk or something or then we'll just pick that up for the most part once every two weeks another 300 dollars exactly today um but because it lasted two weeks that's actually not that bad so that's about 600 dollars a month in groceries i'm gonna try to go through as fast as i can to put everything away i apologize about my child crying over there we got the groceries delivered exactly when it was time for the kids to go to sleep so they're not too happy about the situation so let me first show you what we have left over so this is what we have left over in the pantry so as far as snacks goes we have two of those left two of those left we do have some soups left but not much we have the whole cereal left i still have a bunch of rice i have brown rice some condiments here still have pancakes and then cheddar broccoli and then barely anything up here canned a good section i still have some pasta left over I do have some beans and i'm pretty sure i got some beans in this order in the refrigerator I did go back and get two more of these. If you see my vlog, I'm like obsessed with that. I have a little bit of milk left. I do have a little bit of milk left there as well. We do have like maybe two eggs left, some bread. Oh, and then some kibasa and the ham and hot dogs. And then as far as the kids snack goes, we have three cheese sticks left, pudding, and then one fruit cup left. And then just like more condiments and stuff on this side. Okay, and then the freezer, we do have probably like two left of the waffles, a little bit of the steakums. Um, still have a lot of frozen veggies down there. Uh, one pack of those, some chicken nuggets, hot pockets, and that's it. So yeah, so definitely running pretty low on almost everything. But I think I probably still could have whipped up some some dinners for the next couple of days. But I will do that to my family. Let me just go through one by one and show you everything that we got in this haul today. Pumpkin loaves, some more soup, yogurts, two different flavors. This was substituted instead of the cheese sticks. They gave me the cheese cubes, which sucks. Another shredded cheese, cookies, boneless chicken bites, some more cheddar broccoli. We love these things. Some more pasta, some sasson, because I ran out. Pizza, turkey beef, some more burgers, because we actually really like them. I like how I made them last time. And then I just got somewhere in here a burger seasoning, just to like give it the burgers a little bit more flavor. But this actually turned out pretty good last time. Some whipped cream, orange juice, some more milk, some canned goods. Oh, never mind. I got some more caramel syrup. I like the Goya brand for the pigeon peas, but they substituted it to this brand. They said they didn't have any. So I got red beans. Uh, that sucks. They gave me a dented one. Pinto bean. Chili. A pasta sauce. Parmesan cheese. Velveeta mac and cheese for the kids. A different flavor of Hot Pockets. Pizza rolls. Bigger bag of pierogies. Potato smiley. Tortellini pasta. More bagel bites for the kids. Applesauce pouches. Some meatballs. They ended up substituting 20 of our items. So I got the bigger size that gives you more for less, but they substituted for this and still charged me the $2 more, which is very annoying. But taquitos. Lettuce, I, I just asked for a regular like lettuce thing and they substituted it for this one, which is a lot more expensive. More waffles, the cereal bars, some honey buns, some cookies, raisin bread, hamburger bread, bagels, tomatoes, bananas, iced tea, green tea, some avocados, bunions, goldfish, oatmeal cookies, cheese dipping sticks, aluminum foil, M&M's, goobers, gum, spicy noodle cups, alfredo sauce, hot dogs, bacon, pork roll, these little lunchables things. Zeke ended up really liking this, Melina not so much. I got two of these P3 things, fajita sauce, M&M's, this is that hamburger seasoning I was telling you guys about. Rotel, and then tortilla strips, pretzels, burritos. We're having a get together this weekend for New Year's Eve, so I got some extra snacks. This was a substitution. I wanted the banana nut muffins, but they gave us a cheese danish instead. I know I'm gonna like these, but nobody else in the house is, so that sucks too. Oatmeal, pop tarts. This is another substitution. I was trying to get the same pack of almonds that I got last time for him, but they substituted it to this one. So hopefully he actually likes this pack. And then they also substituted their fruit smileys. They gave him the tangy fruit smileys. So I don't know if they're gonna like this one either, but we'll see. Cajun trail mix. So we wanted to try something new. I wanted vanilla pudding and they substituted it for chocolate pudding. So I doubt anybody is gonna eat this. Slappy Joe sauce, Tostitos, and another pizza. Ordered some more eggs. It's almost up to $6 now, crazy. Some Coke, um, some Purex, we're out of laundry detergent, Sprite, potatoes, and then a pack of water. 
and that's it that's our entire grocery haul this should last us two weeks and we do eat out at least once a week it just varies on the day depends on if i really don't want to cook that day or if it's like a weekend we'll, we'll eat out but i do also calculate into the fact that tommy does eat out for lunch every single day he doesn't like leftovers so i don't cook enough leftovers for him i just cook enough leftovers for me and the kids for the next day and then we'll eat leftovers for lunch so you can factor in maybe an extra 50 60 bucks a week on what he spends so roughly about 800 dollars as a family of four a month on groceries so i think in this time that we're in right now that's actually pretty okay i guess so that's it for the grocery haul and then tomorrow i'll just go through and just take out all the boxes and just organize everything a little bit so yeah so we'll do that tomorrow